more than 90% of crypto traders lose money why because they are not trading against people they are trading against literal bots these bots they never sleep they don't get emotional and they never miss an opportunity now i was tired of going through all the technical analysis and trying to beat the market by myself so instead i built my own ai trading bot and in this video i will tell you exactly how you can replicate the entire process and no this is not just theory i've been in the crypto space for more than 5 years as a blockchain developer I've tried and tested out multiple trading bots but they never actually work or are highly priced. So instead we will be building our own AI trading bot completely for free and all you have to do is just follow along. Making such type of videos takes a lot of time and effort so if you like such videos then do press the like button and subscribe to the channel and let's get onto my laptop and I'll show you the entire bot. Okay so here are the three simple steps that you need to follow along with me to create your own crypto trading bot. Now the tools that we are using or trading view there's wonder trading and then binance or any of your preferred centralized exchanges that you mainly use here i'm using binance just to showcase the capabilities for it now the first thing that you need to do is create your pine script in trading view i'll explain what pine script is and everything else along with that but first you need to come on tradingview.com and open up btc usdt chart because this is the chart on which we'll be doing all the trading you can choose other cryptocurrencies as well like solana or any other but here for simplicity we'll be going with bitcoin tether which is usdt now make sure you have chosen the correct centralized exchange as well that you'll be using further down the video now let's go over to the pine editor it should be over here now here you need to code out your entire strategy this is the entire crux of your bot it decides where the bot will place a buy order and where it will place a sell order now to keep things simple and showcase you the real possibility of such bots i have made my own pine script over here and i'll explain what this script is all about and where it is placing these buy orders along with that you can see the strategy tester and you can already see that on the 5 minute chart it has already generated over 2000 dollars in profit made a total of 155 total trades which is quite crazy and you can see all the list of trades that it has made and you can also see them on this particular graph these are the buy orders and then these are the sell orders so you can literally see that it actually predicted that the chart will go up and it has placed the buy order and then it has placed the sell order right at the top so these are certain things that you need to code out over here and let's try to understand what is this exact code written over here now i've coded out and tested 20 plus strategies all in a bundle so if you want your hands on that bundle then just press the link in the description box or in the pin comments but here is the free strategy that you can view and test out so this is one of the strategies that i had created over here you can see that the strategy's name i've kept it as custom rsi momentum now here the major part lies in these three values the 7 65 and 20 values essentially what this strategy does is it is calculating rsi's length rsi's entry and exit as well to determine where it should be buying and where it should be selling in a particular graph so over here i have kept it to 7 65 20 i'll explain what these three values stand for but if you already understand rsi then you can skip ahead to the later part of this video so over here rsi is a very strong indicator of past movements of course inherently it does not predict what the future holds and it cannot predict if it will go up or it will go down but it can give you a fair idea if you put in the correct values over here rsi length stands for calculating the number of candlesticks that you want in your calculations next is rsi entry this value goes from 0 to all the way up to 100 now keeping a value above 50 means that you are taking an entry when there is a bullish momentum here i've put in 65 for a safer bullish momentum only when we see a bullish momentum only when we see the chart going up that is where we are taking in the entry and we have kept it quite safe if you want a much safer version then instead of 65 you'd probably put in 75 or even 80 but then there would be less number of trades 
happening on this chart. That's the only key difference. Now, the next part is 20, which is RSI exit. This value signifies the exit position. Essentially, when do you want to exit that position? Its value also goes from 0 to 100 and it shows a bearish momentum if the value goes below 50. Essentially, a value below 50 shows that the graph is going down. But there could be false alarms and that's why we've kept it to around 20 for the safer side. And then apart from that, we can see in the code, we've also kept in certain comments. Now these comments, I'll talk about them later in the video when we talk about Wonderbot. So here we are just sending signals to our bot and telling it if it should take in a position or it should exit a position. So these are the only things that are going on in the Pine editor. I've already coded this and it will be available for free for you guys. And if you want more 20 plus strategies, then you can buy the entire bundle. Now let's move over to the second step, which is connecting trading view with wonder trading. So how do we do that? Let's look at that over here in detail. So first go over to wonder trading and open up an account if you already have one this is not a sponsored video at all this is just a tool that i've used personally and i'm currently using for this entire trading bot here you'll be able to see signal bot this is where you need to create your bot now you can see that i've already created a bot and connected it with my exchange which is binance futures so in order to connect it with your exchange you first need to log into your exchange as well so let's go over to Binance, which is the exchange that I'm using for this video and I'll connect it with my wonder trading bot. Okay. So once you're there on the exchange here, I'm using Binance. You can use any, just go over to your settings. All right. And go over to account and API management. Here is where we'll be connecting wonder trading with our Binance or any exchange. Now here I've already added the API, but if you don't have it, create API and then use a system generated one. You can use a self generated one as well. Then click next. And after putting in the API key, which is wonder and after labeling your key, you can label it to whatever you want. I'm just going to write wonder. You will get the key. Okay. So the next thing is to enable futures and spot. Now this might not be on by default. So you need to change it to restrict access to trusted IPs only. And where do you get these IPs from? Well, you have to come back to Wonderbot and then click on my exchanges and then we'll connect our exchange, which is Binance. So let's connect it. So here we have Binance, just scroll down to actions and connect and then click on real account connect. And then here there would be certain instructions. That is what you have to follow. So here, just copy this IP and this is the IP that we need to paste over here. Once you've pasted it, just confirm these are all the IPs and then you'd be able to turn on enable futures as well as enable spot. Once you've done that, just save it and copy your API key. That is what you'll have to paste to your Wonderbot account over here. So API account as well as API secret, and then just click on connect and your exchange should be connected by then. So because I've already done that, I can just directly come on signal bot and start trading. Okay, so in your signal bot, create a new bot, name it, whatever you want and add a description for it. And then you have to select your spot or futures. Whatever you select, you can either go directly with spot trading, which is buying and selling of crypto assets directly, or you can even go with futures where you can get leverage. For example, if you have 100 USDT, you can even make trades worth of 300, 400 or even 500 USDT. So I'll go with futures over here. Next is API. You have to connect your API, which you've already done. So just select that. Then you have to select the pairs with which you want to trade. For example, I just want to trade with Bitcoin. So I'll just select Bitcoin. Okay. Um, let me select Bitcoin, BTC, USDT, and one more, which is BTC, USDT. Okay. I've selected BTC, USDT perpetual. After that, you have time frame. You have other things as well. These are certain things that you can keep according to your requirements. You can even place DCA orders, which is dollar cost averaging. Now, apart from this, if you want to directly follow what I did for my bot, then you can look at it over here. You can see all the conditions and every single thing that I've placed 
and you can take a quick screenshot of it and and follow the same filters for the bot now once you've added the bot the next thing would be alerts all of these alerts would be given to you and this is what you need to place in trading view this is the last step and after this we'd be able to automate all of our trades but here there is one small hack that you would have to do so here in trading view if you go over to alerts you would not be able to create new alerts this is because Alerts are only available in the paid plan of trading view. So why did I claim that this is completely for free? Well, there is actually a way in which you can create alerts for free on trading bot as well. All you have to do is go over to trading bots profile and click on explore our plans. Here it will ask you to pay a certain amount. You don't have to do that. Just click on any of these plans and here there will be a free trial option for the next 30 days. This is what we'll be utilizing in order to get the entire setup for free. Yes, you would have to add in your credit card or debit card details, but that is one of the things that you'd have to do. But apart from that, this is a completely free trial for the next 30 days. So before your trial ends, you can cancel the plan. That's what you can do to get the entire setup for free without paying a single dollar. Now we were talking about alerts. Now, once you're there on the free trial of the premium plan, then just click on alerts and we'll create a new alert. So click on create alert. Over here, you have to select the condition. Apart from that, you can select the chart timings. So here I am keeping it same as chart or we can change it to one minute or even one day as well. But I'll keep it to five minute chart. And this is a symbol. Apart from that, you'd have to go into the message and set this particular message. This would be there in your signal bot as well. Here is the alert message. This is something that you need to copy and paste it over here. Remove any other things that are already there in the message and then just click on save. Once you've done this, your alert will be active and you'll start making automatic trades. Now I understand that some of the people might find this entire process to be very complicated. So if you want me to set up this entire bot for you, then I'll keep a link in my description box as well as in the pinned comments. You just have to fill up a quick form and I'll contact you and we can set up the bot together for you. Now that's it for this video. If you like this video, then do press the subscribe button. Do like this video and share this video with your friends. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.